Hey, it's Zombie, and today is day number 21 of 30 Days of Beauty. 21. Wow. Anyway, today just happens to be top five blushes. I put up 10 fingers. Top five blushes. So I'm going to be showing you my top five blushes. I'm going to tell you where I got them, what I like about them, swatch them for you. So we might as well just jump right into it. I'll start with this TIGI blush. It is in the color Brilliance. And it just looks like this. It's kind of a nice shimmery blush. And here's a swatch. Now, I got this blush, I think in a glossy box last year. Yeah, and it was one of the first blushes I got when I started, you know, collecting makeup again. And it's, you got to use it sparingly because it is very opaque when you apply it. So, if you have, I mean, if you're interested in TIGI, I can look up their website below or look where to find it and I can link it below. That will help you guys. Uh, I really like it. It's shimmery. I can do shimmery. The next one I'm going to show you guys is Almay's Wake Up Blush. This one, does it have a name? Does this have a name? Do, oh, this is Berry. And it just looks like this. And I like that it comes with the highlighter, which I'll swatch both of those for you. I'll swatch the highlighter and the blush. Now, as you can see, these aren't as dark as the other ones. They're very buildable. This, I've heard bad things about this, but this works for me. It's buildable. People say that, I've seen people say that when they use it, it doesn't show up. Because it's buildable, you're not just going to expect to take a completely sheer lipstick and put it on and it'd be completely opaque, right? Okay, so I got this on sale. I think I got it for like $2 and I got it at Walgreens and I've had it for a while. And that's actually what I'm wearing today. And it's it's very subtle, very light. And I like that in a blush. My next two are going to be Maybelline blushes and they're from the Fit Me collection. This is from the early on when Fit Me was going on. It doesn't have the big fit across it. This color is the color Pink Peony, which it just looks like this. And then I'll swatch that. And it's just very subtle pink. Very pretty. And it's got nice shimmer to it. I got this on sale at Walgreens too. I can't remember how much it was. No, wait, yeah. I think I got it on sale at Walgreens. It was like a dollar for it. I was like, a dollar? the hell so I picked that up and I use it often the next is a newer fit me it is in medium pink it just looks like this it's nice shimmer a lot of my blushes are very shimmery I like shimmery blushes it's kind of uh, it kind of reminds me of the TIGI it's just lighter and it's I really like this blush well, I mean, these are my top five. Of course, I like these blushes. It just is very pretty, and it looks really good on the cheeks. And last but not least, this is a blush that I've fallen in love with since I've got it. It is Hervana from Benefit. Good karma, right? And, of course, it comes with the adorable angled brush. And it's this nice multicolored blush. It's got like highlight colors and bronze colors and purples and pinks. And it just, they all mix together so well. Just, let me give you a little swatch of that. It is like the perfect blush in my opinion. I just, I love this and it's so matte. This is a very matte blush. I just, it is great blush. The blush even smells great. It just smells like, like a hint of berry and I like that and it's gonna last forever I've used I use it a lot and it still hardly looks like I've used it at all this thing's gonna freaking last forever so that seemed kind of fast but those are my top five blushes from many different brands I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I hope you all have a great night and I will see you guys tomorrow